Hey, so today I've done my third um, skill acquisition session with the group, and um, and yeah, it was a good good session. So we worked on the A and B skip re A and B skip recap. As I said after session two, I felt it needed to be done, so I was happy we did this. Um, and really just setting the skills home, and we also worked in working around the curve, which was good as well. So I didn't actually neglect that session as the original plan session as much as I as it as expected to, but I, I worked it in well. Um, and then we worked on two skills. So we worked on the on the um, Rabona kick pass, which is the standing leg, and you bring your, the moving leg around to behind the standing leg to kick the ball, to cross the ball, to take a shot, whatever the case may be. And we also um, we also worked on the double step over, which was a progression from the single step over. So again, a good skill, great skill to use in um, in game sense or in real time in an actual match. So. I feel the session went well. I was really happy that I recapped the A and B skips, so the group got a really good understanding and a good feel for these moves. As, as this will come around again, that when they're actually sprinting, the the coaching points of these skills will come into practice. So, I felt it was important to do that, and then we brought those movements into around the bend. <coughs> Excuse me, which was good. Um, just it's just good to get the feel. Of how the how the outside leg might lose a bit of traction, but your inside leg will be slightly deep. But it's maintaining the 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 boot, the body movements, and the the structure of the the drill, I suppose, whilst doing that. So that was good to do. Um, again, this, the group were great when it comes to skills. They're a highly skilled group, so the Rabona kick pass was straightforward for them, to be honest. Um, but in saying that, when you bring it into game sense, when you have them doing this in moving time. In real time, it's very good. And um, the double step over again is a complex skill, but they took to it very well. And um, you could see they're they're all well used to this. These lads are if I've said they're watching the likes of Cristiano Ronaldo, Messi, and they're trying to mimic them every day of the week. So these movement that that skill was quite straightforward to them. But again, bringing it into real time into game time was good. The the, the speed of the skill, um, so that went well, um. Yeah, I felt those aspects of the session went pretty well. So, um, I suppose um, more questions from myself today could have been good, but working working with the um, with the speed and agility, I felt I really had to get in there and set it home to to get them to understand it, as opposed to say asking questions, asking as much questions because I felt the group needed to understand why they were doing it, what they were doing and really get that in, get that mentality into them or get the, the, the coaching points in, set into into their um, their mindset and they obviously teach the, the benefits of it I suppose. Um, yeah so in conclusion overall it was a good session, um, a little bit longer than I had expected but I'm, I'm happy that I went over that a little bit because it was worth my while doing it. Um, I'm, I, like I think next week, you know, we'll see the benefits of that. You know, um, the skills, the skills so far, rather easy for the group. But I feel, with relation to the session planners I have made and designed for them, the the skills will get more complex. There's more balance movement coming in as opposed to just a, a step over. Um, there's more trickery, in the actual movement. It's complexity. So so these will, this will hopefully challenge the group a bit more and. And, uh, and and make skills stand out for them. Um, so yeah, I suppose doing it again. I'm actually, if I was to do it again, I'm really happy that the that I done what I done in relation to teaching the A and B skip again. Um, I was happy that I could bring in the moving around the the bend as well. So all in all, I think it was a good session.